What's up everyone, welcome back to the channel. So in today's video, we're gonna go check on my bolt candy machines. Now they've been sitting for about a month and I haven't really given them any attention. And this is the first stop. So this one was my first candy machine location that I did get and it was at a donut shop. So I, I went in and I asked them and, they, and they, you know, there is competition there. And I think maybe my mistake is that I probably should put toy capsules in there, but I'm not at that point yet. I determined today if I don't have 10 bucks, then I'm pulling the machine out. So we're gonna have to see how it goes. So stick around and don't go anywhere. So it totally breaks my heart to say this, but guys, if it doesn't have 39 quarters in that other machine, I have to take it home. Hey, so I'm gonna take it because it doesn't seem like anyone's really using it. So I'm just gonna take it and I'll put it somewhere else, but I appreciate you guys letting me keep it here for a while. Okay. Thank you. Yeah. All right, see you Oh, really? Okay, thanks so much. Okay. All right, bye-bye. Sure is a sad day when you gotta pull a machine, but honestly, I don't think I've even collected $4 from this location, so I don't think this is a good fit. I'm on the fence with quitting the gumball machine business, but I think I'm just gonna revamp. I'm gonna try to use toys and actual gumballs. As you can see, I've been started off with Skittles and M&Ms, and one of my locations does pretty well with the Skittles and M&Ms, but uh, Donut Shop is not really the best location. But we're gonna go check on our bar location, and same thing. That thing's been there for almost two months. I know at least a month. So if it's not, uh, if it doesn't have like ten bucks in it, or I'm, I'm, I'm gonna pull it too. So stick around. Don't go anywhere. All right, guys. Like I said, I'm gonna go into this bar location, and if there isn't at least five to ten bucks in there, I gotta pull it and find a better location. <laughs> um, like I said, I've been mentioning it and kind of talking about it a little bit, but I think that I'm just gonna give my kids my bolt candy machines, um, have them sign up, uh, partner with a charity, and then have them go out and put the footwork in. Um, for me, the juice isn't worth the squeeze so far. I really haven't gotten a good location. However, I do have one machine with my full line machine at my auto body shop, and it does pretty well. It does like uh, about 10 bucks a week. So that's pretty good. That's what I'm looking for. These locations aren't making it happen. So if there's not 10 bucks in there, it's been about four, almost five weeks, I think. Um, I'm, I'm pulling I'm pulling this sucker so uh, put cross cross your fingers in the comment section for me guys I need your help and hit the like button for good luck thanks okay. Making clouds out of 
all right so it did pretty well so i'm gonna leave it here they said they don't want the peanuts because they taste gross which i don't blame them so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna take the donut shop machine and i'm gonna put it in the bar so yeah, that's pretty cool. So um, I lost the location, but I mean, I, I chose to lose it because it wasn't really doing doing it for me. And this location, I'm really surprised that it actually did pretty well. So I'm gonna go ahead and swap it out. I'm gonna put the, the machine in here with Skittles and M&Ms and put it on a 30 day cycle because 30 day cycle apparently is what it needs to be because there was about 10 bucks in there. I got it all in my pocket because I honestly didn't think there'd be any money in there. So anyways, I'm gonna switch them out. It's like impossible to hold the camera and do it at the same time. So we'll see how it goes. Making clouds out of produce Yeah, but mentality is nice to know oh, 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 Broke my attitude, smashing through Hip hop mentality is nice to know Streets want reality, is staying true Hold it down like gravity and got you got oh, Broke my attitude, smashing through Hip hop mentality is nice to know Cool thing is too, since um, the donut lo shop location or the, the donut shop lo location got placed before the bar location, I was able to switch the the M and M's in it. You know, it's not gonna affect the like expiration date and all that stuff. So. All right guys, so that's not bad, 1550. I guess it's been a little over a month, so that's what it's gonna take because when I was going before to that bar location, I was only getting like a dollar, maybe $2. So I just kind of forgot about it for about a month and then went back and checked on it and it seems like that's gonna have to be the cycle. So I'm gonna leave that machine there and I'm gonna leave the machine, the bulk machine at my soda machine location. I have three more machines. So my daughter wants to place one, my older daughter wants one. So I technically have one double head left that I could try to find a good location for. And if I get a good like honor box location, maybe I'll ask if I could place a gumball machine. Anyways, that's the video for today, guys. I really appreciate you watching. If you made it this far, make sure to hit the thumbs up button and subscribe because I put like two to three videos out a week and you don't want to miss one. And um, if you guys have a candy machine business and you need labels, the place that I get the labels from that I recommend the most is CandyMachineLabelsAndMore.com. I'll leave a link in the description below. And um, scroll down, there's all kinds of cool links in that description. A lot of more uh, vending channels if you love the vending related stuff and a lot of other cool YouTube channels. I mean, you can't go wrong. It's a, it's a database of the best channels on the internet. So go down and check it out. All right, I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching.